Yeah, we got him. Did it do much damage? Not really. Got him again. One more time. <laughs>
hopefully we don't run into any more of those uh, wizards fighting each other, because they're just a pain in the ass. We seem to run into them every single time we go down here. There's always uh, the mage one and always a nice one. Here we have the... ah, the Netch. They're fighting the Netch, are they? Or is this the same group from before? We have come south to test our worth against the mighty Netch. Will you join us? Heck yeah, why not? Sounds fun. Well met, friend. May we all fight or die well. Hopefully no one dies. Yeah, we got this. Easy peasy. Oh. Stop knocking him away from me. I'm trying to help you. There we go. What else are we fighting here? Oh, an ash hopper. Yeah. We uh, loot that. Boop. Yeah, I'll take the next jelly, sure. They don't need it. Cool. Do we get anything for helping you? What did they? Oh, they're here. They will sing stories of this day. Will they? I don't know. They will sing stories of this day. <laughs> I mean, I suppose they're the only ones going back saying, "Oh yeah, it was an epic fight. Yeah, it was. It was incredible. We all performed backflips and um, I don't know, shot it with arrows while flying through the air." Who's going to tell them that they're wrong? Apart from me, I guess. I'm the liability now. I mean, everybody exaggerates those sort of stories, right? Right? Well, come on, we all do that, right? Something cool happens and you kind of exaggerate. You embellish it a little bit. You don't make it crazy, but I'm pretty sure everybody... Jeez. Everybody kind of embellishes stories a little bit because it's how he is, you know, it makes the story a bit more interesting. If you just told it as it, as it happened, it can be a bit, bit, bit dull. Hmm. Well, yeah. Yeah, it really kind of rams home how small this, uh... Oh, there they are. <laughs> we found them. Rams, how, rams home how small this map is because, uh... I don't know, I always remember this taking ages. I don't know why I ever thought it took ages, probably because I used to fast travel and having to run it seemed so weird, but now we run this stuff all the time. Feels like a piece of piss, right? Let's deal with this one first. Hello! Bonk! Oh, she's angry. And she's dead. Hagraven feathers? Oh, she was going to hag out on us. Start calling. Turn into a bird. What about you? What are you going to turn into? What do you got on you? Ooh, a dragon's tongue. He's going to turn into a dragon. Or, or a pine thrush. <laughs> One of the two. Sure. Right, we'll take you. We'll take you, Steph. Do we need to stop in at uh, Tell Mifrin? Do we need to talk to what's his face? Do we have any reason to talk to him again? What, what is his body called? Nelof. Yeah, Nelof. Thinks he's the main character in the story. <laughs> okay. Get up and over that. Can we actually get up that? No, we can't. We've got to go around. Boo! Making me run. Oh, God. Right. Let's get our stamina regen a little bit, because it is useful for combat. There they are. A lot of ash zombies and a dude. Bonk! Oh, my, my, uh, my chance are broken. <laughs> take that, Erden! I can take a couple of punches, I'm not worried about them, I'm worried about your magic. Back up to 90. 
He's got the mask of Dagoff Ur on, hasn't he? Well, let's get rid of the corpus. Corpus zombies or whatever they are. Thankfully, because we put the stamina enchant on this, it's a uh, power attack central. I think once we go to the two-handed again with the... Oh, where'd you come from? You just saw a party and wanted to join in, did you? Let's uh, heal up a bit then, because these guys are a little tougher. Yeah, once we get to two-handed, uh, we, we want to use the staff, and I think for that, rather than power attacks, we're probably going to focus on the little block... What is that, block punches? What do you call it? Bl bl block hit? Something like that. And just normal attacks, because yes, they take stamina, but I think you can just do those even when you're like really low stamina. Right? Oh, actually, our stamina's recharging while we're doing that, so we're fine. Erden Ralvel. Hey, he's got the Forge Gem. Nice. Drink your ale. Celebrate. Gold taken at lockpick. Sure. Swordfish eating. Mask of Dagoth Ur. Dunk. And Robe of the Lich. Magicka regens 150% faster. It's unique. I'm taking it. And an Ebony Dagger. Hmm. Interesting. Do we have to go back to the Priestess or is that literally us done for her? How do we get our quests up? Oop, there we go. Oh, yeah, that's right. We got a letter from Rallis saying come back to the excavation. So we should probably do that at some point. But let's uh, let's actually do this. We've got all four of the gems, and we've placed one already. We've got to enchant and restore true flame. Have we still got the unenchanted one? I think we do. Yeah, we do. Okay, cool. Uh, let's do that. Yeah, why not? But no, we've not got anything to come back to on the Tribunal Heretics, so maybe we we could potentially fight them if we want to, or we could just leave them be. Like we don't need to take them down. We don't really gain anything for it, I don't think. Maybe we do. Maybe like the priestess has has got like the the matriarch's got something fun on her. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll think about it. I'll tell you what. We'll leave it up into up to the comments, right? Like, there's no, there's no harm in us leaving it for a, a week or two, right? Oh. Yeah, we'll just stand on either side of this barbecue, right? And <laughs> swing, uh, swing our weapons very manly. Wow, they are doing a bit of damage to me, actually. Ooh. Not used to that. Not used to that. Come here, you. There we go. So the her hand stuff is not great, but it is also giving us a bit more of a challenge, so I don't know, I'm kinda of like keeping it then. It's it's unique too, like it, it fits us, right? It looks really cool. I, I it's one of those armors that I, I kinda dig. It definitely fits the theme that we're going with here. Like it just it just works. I don't know, it works. Oh, where were you? You just buggered off and left me. Oh, were you dealing with that one? A Nord. <laughs> Come on then. Bring it on. Come on. <laughs> I love a challenge. Do you? You're running away from me. Come on. Ah! It's got a spear. Oop. Buggered that up, didn't I? Let's grab our oop, ebony mace. There we go. Bring it on. Will ya? Bonk. They don't seem to be getting the slowdown effect when they're uh, doing a power attack on us. I don't know if that's a bug or something else I don't know let's take those yeah there we go nice nicely done to the heal switch back to our shield 
Now I'm gonna drop a quick save too. Oh look at that! We dropped a quick save and we didn't we didn't we didn't crash. Ah, oh, I don't think I've ever done a quick save previous to that. Maybe I don't know. Not since the crashes, I don't think. I don't know. Either way, it's nice. <laughs> it's nice to not have to worry about that. Worry, worry. You. There we go. Bonk. Yeah, you just got the next hand meat. Is it actually good for us? 18 points of hunger, I guess. What's uh it's kinda kinda rancid looking. <laughs> but, but hey, we'll eat it. We're game to try that sort of stuff. And we've got the raw diet perp, we can do that. We're not gonna get some uh crazy sickness from it. Yeah, where is this? Oh man, it's all the way over there. Uh, we might be best going this way to the left and round because I don't want to go over the mountain. That seems like a recipe for disaster. It seems to be where we crash the most after we fix the game, so uh, let's avoid that, right? Is that a path? That looks like a path to me, right? Let's take it. Oh, yeah, we know that this is the, the werewolves, yeah. Can we actually go this way up past them? No, we can't. Oh, boo. All right, well, we'll avoid them for now. I do want to come back here when we're a werewolf, though, because I know you can get uh, some pretty good perks from them. I think, like, special rings, because they recognize you as one of their own. And that's uh, that's kind of a fun little thing. Fun little, little tidbit of knowledge, if you didn't know. If you're a werewolf and you go there, they... They accept you, they welcome you into the camp, and I think there's three different rings that you can get that give you specific bonuses for being a werewolf. Is being a werewolf good in Skyrim? I mean, it was on normal difficulty. Is it on legendary? Probably not, because it's hand-to-hand, -hand, right? Hand-to-hand -hand combat does not scale well with the difficulty. Alright, we're going to have to deal with the reclings again. We are! Hurrah! Okay, that's fine. I didn't think we'd been away that long, but apparently... Oh god, they hit hard. Oh god, you hit real hard. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, at least we went back to the quick save. <laughs> right? That's not far. That's not far away. Okay. Good. But maybe we keep the healing spell up. Alright. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Good. Right. We wanted to go... Oh, how did we want to get there? This way. So yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm kind of, kind of surprised at how bad this armor is doing. I thought we were onto something with this armor. I figured it was, it was protection enough, but uh, apparently not. I'd like to stick with it a little bit longer, right? Oh, some ash hoppers, I don't want to give a shit about them. Main goal is getting into that Dwemer ruin. Oh, they're coming. Not for long, though. Fast as fuck. Right, let's, let's go. Uh, still feels weird. That this series, like just in general, the the the, the Scar and the Bethesda stuff, I've kind of re relieved myself of that burden of of making it family friendly as such, because this, the Minecraft stuff is always going to stay that way, and I'm fine with that to be honest, because it, it it feels like a a switch. These games are a bit more stressful, and oh, they're a bit more stressful than Minecraft, and. <laughs> I can't hold, I don't want to keep restarting uh, recordings because I accidentally swear or something. Minecraft, you can re-record stuff, it's fine, it's not a problem. But uh, this this stuff, yeah, you 25 minutes into it. I don't want to go through and, and censor everything as well, That's it feels a bit extreme. It is what it is. I, I imagine most people watching this will be adults, so 
That's out of language. Sorry. But it is freeing. It is nicely, nice and freeing. Because you know, I, I think most people... Oh. Now the Reeklings are gone. No, they're not. They're there. Okay, let's uh, switch to healing. Right. Thankfully, no more damage is done. Oh, there's a dragon. Oh, jeez. Eat it. Gold, take it. Alright, still you. Bonk. Bonk. Yeah, there we go. One more up there. You're a warrior, so you're slightly tougher. Whoop. Ow. There we go. Wow, it's right in my, my, my shoulder blades. It's a pain in the ass. Alright, we are getting very cold out here too. Oh, a Debella statue. I mean, I'll take it. Why not? Fire and whatever. Yeah. Nah, nothing there. Okay. Oh yeah, we had that pirate book, didn't we? What was it called? From Star to Last Death Brand. Yeah, we've 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 looked at that already, but we've we've obviously not done the quest yet. There is a quest related to it. Find all of Death Brand's chests and do some bullshit. Okay. Now these guys shouldn't have respawned, right? Oh no, they might be, because I think this... We crashed. We were still crashing, weren't we? And when I... When I came through here last... Oh jeez. I, uh... Thanks, Ilya. When we came back through here, I just ran through. I didn't fight anything. So I was just basically trying to get back to the place we were at. Oh. That too? Warming up a bit too, which is nice. I mean, I wasn't as lucky with the the trap room as I was the previous time. I couldn't remember which one I pressed, so I did up like taking a bunch of damage from the blades and, and stuff like that that was in here. Oh well. Hey! See if I can remember. I think it's like top second, maybe. Take the soul gem. So I feel like it was this one. Nope, it was not that one. That was a guardian button. So it's not that one. Okay, so second bottom. Oh, yeah, there we go. Second bottom. Okay, so we take this back in here, we put the Pyroyal Tar on it, and, which I think we've already done. And then we put the Forge Gems, Ghostly Remains. Oh. Is that the last person who used the Forge? It was one of the Dwemer and he just disappeared? I don't know. Or is, or is that... Was that Kenro? Yeah, the, we've kind of bogged it out a little bit because the gem's gone there. Whoa, shit. Nice. Oh, that's cool. That's 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 screenshot material. Let's, <laughs> let's drop a save there. Uh, yeah, I'll overwrite that one. Pick up True Flame. Nice. Ah, right, let's have a look at True Flame. So now we've got True Flame and the other one. I can't remember what the other one was. We put it away. Uh, weapons, True Flame. Burns the target for 30 points. Targets on, ex fi on fire take extra damage. Yeah, okay. So we've got some interesting new weapons there. They actually do quite a bit of damage for a base weapon. Interesting. I am going to find someone to put this random bull bullshit I've got on me. Um, Let's see, it is weapons I want to get rid of. Dwarven arrow, ebony arrow, iron arrow, spear, steel arrow. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, they may, they may be the remains of Kenro. Although I thought he was wearing robes and not armor. To the Pyroyal Tar again. Interesting. So maybe we can make more of those? 
Yeah, those gems stay in there. So maybe we can put another unenchanted weapon there? I'm guessing it'll do the same thing though. It'll put on the, uh, the whatchamacallit. God, what is, what are we, what, what, what's it called? The, the fire? <laughs> the fire enchant, there we go. My brain's going to mush. It's, uh, it's been a long day. <laughs> it's been a long, long day. Whoop, avoid that trap, thank you very much. Please do the same, Ilya. I do not want to be carting around your limbs for a bit. Right. What do we do next? I don't want to take on the the tribunal heretics because we said we were going to leave that to you guys to decide whether we take them on or not. It could be fun. We might as well go back and get the masks though, right? We'll go back and get the masks and then I guess we continue with the main story here. So let's get that activated and see what we got to go next. Uh, why can we not do quests? There we go. Or we could do Colburn Barrow. Colby on Barrow. I kind of want to do that. Relis is a nutter. I like I like Relis. He is a strange man. He's hearing voices. He's just going slowly insane as his expedition goes on like I am with this playthrough of Skyrim. <laughs> just slowly losing all sanity. Alright. Uh, Zoop. Have we actually got any skill points? No, but we are close to leveling up. We could level up heavy armor, but I don't want to do that. There's, there's certain ones now where I'm like, I don't... I don't want to go through that again. <laughs> Enchant... I don't want to go through enchanting again. I know you, it's one of the easier ones to do again, but I don't want to go through that shit again. <laughs> I like being able to get stuff and not having to wait till I level up to 100 again. Uh, anyway. Colbion Barrow. How far away is that? It's probably not that far, is it? Is this... So there's the... the bulwark. So we should just be over this ridge, I think. Maybe? Maybe? Oh, we also need to grab his diary, too. Yeah, we're getting there. We're almost there. Excellent. We should sleep. I wonder if we can sleep outside. Might not get us to full... ...energy, but it will be better than what we're at at the moment, which is pretty tired. Our spells are not very good. Uh, can we sleep on any of these? Yes, we can. Uh, let's have a sleep till morning then. Hopefully it's not cold and we freeze to death. We don't freeze to death. No, we are. We are good. And we seem to be fully. Oh no, we've got a little bit. We're still a little bit tired, which is what happens when you sleep outside in um, survival mode. So that's fine. Rallis, where's the crew? Where are all the people? Oh. I was hoping I wouldn't see you quite so soon. Well, tough shit. I'm giving you money. Where, where the hell are the workers, buddy? Journal of Rallis Sedaris. Let's put on our Rallis voice, shall we? The Journal of Rallis Sedaris. Volume 22. If it weren't for the comfort brought by my invisible friend, I would have fled this place long ago. I wish I had realized earlier that it was not a group but a master who contains multitudes. He's guided me into a true understanding of the Barrow, and I greatly desire to meet with him. My insight into this place is now so intuitive, so fundamental, that I almost feel as if I built it myself. I explained to the workers how to use the tile set, but they seem too afraid or uncoordinated to properly step on each tile quickly enough. No problems. Nothing that the master cannot solve. We will be able to converse properly soon enough. Is he talking to Azadal? Huh? Feels that way? Yeah, huh, Ilya, huh. I'm confused by what's going on too. Rallis, you're a madman, what's uh, going on? I was hoping I wouldn't see you quite so soon. Oh, uh, it looks at least like some of the miners survived this time. Yes, well, the mercenaries did their jobs. 
Worth every cent of them. Of course, they might disagree. The dead ones, anyway. Gods, what a disaster. Yes. I feel like we've done this before. But that just means we're getting good at it. You go make the Draugr dead again, and I'll keep the rest of these Enwars from dunning off. <laughs> Good luck. Uh, oh, this guy's this guy's keen free. He's going straight back in. Or is he? What's he doing? Just having a bit of a puzzle with the, the barrels there. Sure. Sure, buddy. Whatever. More Draugr to deal with, huh? And they all respawn too, so we are going to be dealing with the same ones that we dealt with last time. Hello! Goodbye! Oh, there's a chest here. Was that there before? Did we see that? Has that just been uncovered since we, uh, since the last one? I don't want the arrows. I don't give a shit about those. Ow! Bonk! There we go. Whoa! Hell yeah. Jesus. Calm down. Right. Back into the chamber. Yep, there's people here. They are running at me. Come on, then. Yeah, we are taking more damage from these guys than we did last time. So this armor is not great. We may need to look into the replacement. Maybe we go the Indrial stuff, see what we can do with that. Um, thankfully, we are doing damage, so we can kind of handle it. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? Can we keep this? We've only had it two episodes. Let's let's keep it for now and you know we can always change it. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, there's a word wall here. Can we can we get it yet? No, I'm guessing there must be like one more excavation right before we can before we can get all that out. Alright. Fair enough. Let's go across here like we did last time. Corbjorn Guard. Hello! Oh, I don't know what you're shouting at, but it wasn't me. There we go. Gold, great. Where are we? Where are we going with these guys? Where are you? Hey, some stuff. I'll take it. Okay, nothing here. Don't need to worry about that shit anyway. Um, what was that for? Ah, right. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll leave that open. Been here before. We don't need to worry about this stuff. There's not going to be anything that we have missed. I don't think, especially not now that we've got the the boots back. Oh shit! Hello! Come on, Ilya! Come in here! <laughs> Set the trap off! Yeah! We got him! Did do much damage? Not really. Got him again! One more time! <laughs> oh, perfect comedy. Right, who is raising these assholes to fight us? Some some assholes down here raising miners. Oh, the asshole is Ilya. <laughs> Alright. Oh, Jesus, Ilya. Can't do that. It's forbidden magic. Ooh. That was an expert lock here. Let's uh, have a look behind here, shall we? Seems like there's quite a few dead things behind here. It's kind of disrespectful, Ilya, to be raising the miners. Oh! Spiders. Not what I was expecting. Ooh, poison spiders. Got a level up too, nice. Ah, emerald geodes and shit, okay. Uh, I'm gonna get stabbed, aren't I? I'm gonna get shanked. Yep! That hurt. Ooh, picked up on linen wrap. Let's get rid of that, we don't need it. Uh, let's actually just drop it, right? Linden wrap, was it? I think it was linen wrap, yeah, linen wrap. There we go. Okay, so I think that's just to tell us that, hey, look, these these spiders, you can get poison ones. 
Please use the spiders. Please. No one ever remembers to use us. Uh, well, good job with the miner, though, I guess. Nothing there. We dealt with that one. This guy's dead. Take your ruby. Right, I think we're into a new section now. I don't think we've been here before. Or maybe we have. Oh, or maybe we've not. Bonk. Okay, well, we've got ultimate there as well. Ultimate, yes, I'll take it. Now, oh. hey. Not really interested in uh, fighting, are you not? Well, let's get a sneak attack off of you. Boop. Yeah, nice try. What have you got? Gold. Take it. So is that there. Goes further down. Uh, and we've got that door. Uh, it didn't open up what I thought it was going to open up. Oh. You went down really easy. I'm surprised at how easy that was. Okay, can we, we've got another chain in here we got to pull. Wait, what, what's the what's the dealio? So that goes back out to the. We have been here. We had the boots around here, right? That unlocks... Hey, is that it? Hazardal's got gauntlets of warding. Ow, 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 ow. Quit it. I think we're almost through to them now. I just got this last one. Honk. The last two, I should say. You know, what am I doing? That instantly takes care of one of them. Oh, no, it didn't. He didn't take, he didn't take full damage. I am surprised by that. Why didn't he take full damage? Can we get the burial urn? No, we can't. Draw the Death Lord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scream at me all you like. Three left. Two left. We got this. Yeah, draw the death wards. Not too much of a worry once you get the, the rhythm. Gold, we'll take that. And you, we will take your gold too. Now, what do we have in... Oh, yeah, the... We, we read about this. There's some sort of... Which piece of shit did that? You, come here, you. Knock to you too. De knock it off. Right. There was a thing here, but we don't know what it was that we had to do. Did it actually say what we had to do in it? Let's have a look at the book. Rallus's diary. Uh Rallus Sidaris's diary. The journal of Rallus Sidaris. I'm guessing it's this one. Volume 22? Must be this one. Um, okay, the workers how to use the tile set, but they seem too afraid or uncoordinated to properly step on each tile quickly enough. So we've got to run across all the tiles, I guess? I, I heard a gate, is it this one? I think it is this one. What do we got here? Hey, we've got another piece of gear. Azadel's Ring of Arcana. Well, we've got four items now, so we can get the enchanting bonus, right? So we could make some potentially better weapons. Colby on guard, take your gold. Some soul gems in there, I think. Oop. Don't need them, but, uh, eh, can't hurt, right? What else we got? Mace, garbage, chest. 
So here we've got the boots, the ring, the amulet, and the gauntlets now. So we just need the armor or the helmet. Are there two more items then? Do you get a better enchanting buff if you if you get the whole set on? Oh. Um You know what? Let's try something new. We always go whirl and sprint. Let's uh Let's rock slow time. We've not used it yet. Well, we still got cut in slow motion then. Right, so we're over here, but now what? Oh, chain. There we go. Hey, look at that. It takes us back here. So we've got a shortcut now for next time. That's useful. Let's go talk to Relis. Ten percent enchanting bonus. Well, we need well, as long as we've got like a potion as well. We actually get a bit of a boost though. I don't know how it works. Would it be a total? Like 25% potion, 10% on the armor, so it's a 35% bonus, or if it's like you get the 25% from the potion and then it does like 10% on top of that, so it's another 2.5%. I, I don't know how it works. I don't know how it works. Right, Rallis. Hello. All the Draugr are dead. You're welcome. Good. Glad I can count on you. How much? How I much? I think we're almost to the bottom of the barrel, but but it's going to be everything I can do to find more miners. Mm-hmm. We've developed quite the reputation. Oh, I'm sure we have. But for enough gold, I can do it. Just barely. Don't kill these ones, okay, Rallis? We've killed enough of these people, these poor people on this island. <laughs> like, please stop killing the miners. Stop sending to the death with the Draugr. How much? Five thousand. Oh, pff, it's nothing. I know you could almost buy a house for that much, but like I uh, said, not in Skyrim. The reputation out here. Or is it? Or maybe you and can. Is the only for a bad oh no, you can. Isn't um, you Breeze Home five k? As a matter of fact, I do. Here you go. Good, good. This time I'll spring for some more experienced muscle. Please do. Like, I, I'm really disappointed that so many people in Skyrim and Solstom are dying to Draugr. It's really kind of... kind of shit. <laughs> if I'm honest, they're terrible. Why have you got a child's doll in here? Oh, bless. Poor Rallis is having nightmares. He's got a little toy. Oh, he's this he's he's poor wee sensitive soul. <laughs> Alright. Right, so what do we do now? We, we're almost at the end of this episode, but I want to do something before we before we finish up here. So let's uh, have a quick look what we've got here. Healing a house. We've got to get free tra tap roots. We haven't done that. Can't do that yet. Talk to Storm. That's the main quest, isn't it? Oh. Promise me to teach me the third word, but only in return for the secrets of the skull. I mean, we could do that, or we could try and find that uh, Death Brand one, right? Let's have a look if we can find the Death Brand stuff. Yeah, let's search for the treasure of Death Brand. Let's do that. Onwards! We must find the pirate treasure. Let's see what we got. Probably going to over encumber myself again because we, we really haven't learned our lesson. So we can't carry much in Skyrim. Uh, Oblivion? We, we can carry everything we want. We, we've got strength out the wazoo at the moment. I think our carry, carry weight's like 400 and something. And we're not even like maxed out on strength. Well, what, are you, what are you? Oh! Spriggan. Give us a tap root, will you? I don't know what the burnt Spriggans do. Heal. Thank you very much. Right. You're going to drop down and explode? Oh, no, you're not going to explode. Okay, I thought they exploded. 
I'm kind of wary about it though. I feel like they, they that it will at any point. Right. I'm guessing this Death Brand quest is going to take us around the entire island, right? We're going to be trekking literally everywhere. How are we going to dig it up? Do we have to have a shovel? Is that a mechanic in this? That you got to have a shovel to dig up treasure? I don't remember it being a mechanic. I know it's a mechanic in... I want to say Fallout New Vegas? To dig up graves and stuff like that? Can we get up here, please? There we go. Right, can we... Is this actually a peak? Probably not a peak. Because we're at the Temple of Mirac, aren't we? Yeah, that's not a peak. Don't need to bother climbing that then. I imagine there's probably a cultist or two that we've got to beat up here, right? By night we reclaim. Sure, whatever, buddy. Uh, the stones are free. Yeah, it's just the temple, and I think for that you need to have the full bend will to kind of break the spell and, and ruin his temple and kind of just shit on his plans. But, I mean, he's been he's been mocking us. He's been stealing our dragon souls and just gloating. So he kind of. Khan has it coming, right? He's a dick. He deserves it. <laughs> Mirak deserves a little bit of retribution. So I'd like to get onto that at some point soon. Deathbrand's treasure. We've got what going on? Um, where are we? Are we heading to the water? I suppose we've got the uh, flame cloak now we can use, which is is good. But uh, if we can avoid it, I would like to avoid it. No, no, we can run right across. That's fine. Okay, pirates, have at ye! Hup. Ow! Quit it! Hackner's shoal was it or something? Pirate mage, what do you got? Potion of magic. I'm gonna take it. Hello! Okay, thank you. Deal with you. Take your golden lockpick. What have you got in here? Ooh, fish. Oh yeah, fishing. <laughs> I forgot that was a thing in the game. <laughs> hey, now they've, they've dug it up for us. Okay, ancient chest. That's what we're looking for. Ooh, wow, well, okay. Not, not right in the middle. Oh, there. I felt a little bit of give. So we are somewhere around here. Oh, a bit more? No, a bit more this way. Ooh, close. Okay. Maybe here. Up a bit. There we go. What do we got? Death Brand Helm. Ooh, it's Stalrum. Interesting. Water breathing. Plus 100 armor while wearing a complete set of Death Brand armor. That kind of means... Oh, flight armor too. Kind of means nothing to us because we can make stuff better with smithing to the point that that's redundant, right? That doesn't actually bother us in the slightest. Coin purse. Stuff to sell. We've got some grilled chicken breast. I mean, we'll take it on the baked potatoes. I've sold that. What else we got? No, nope, nothing right. We've got a dude over here. In fact, what is this place called again? It is Hackney's Shoal. Okay, so it is a fishing type place. Pirate Captain. Yar, I have at ye. And all that kind of stuff. Have you got a trident? Ah, oh, I'm so glad we added this mod. Because pirate with a trident. Hot shit. Love it. Okay. Again. Saying mercy after your head has left your body is a bit of a bold move. <laughs> Let's see if it pays off. What have you got? What is it? Oh, he's got a treasure, treasure map. And he's got Death Brand. Okay, yeah, that's that's that makes sense. Orcish Trident. It does look cool. I do dig that. That is cool. Maybe we want to wield a Trident when we do two-handed again. I don't know. I kind of like the idea of being like a bit of a, a, a cat monk. Going around and just bashing stuff with a, a staff, quarter staff, but uh, I don't know. A cat with a trident? Are we digging it? 
cat's claws? I don't know, what do we call it? Cat's claws, maybe? Hmm. Anyway, I think that might be where we leave it for the episode. Uh, so next episode we will probably continue on with our... What was that that flew over? Oh, a little bird. Uh, let's go ahead and zap that one too. Zap. I don't think it's going to have anything different, is it? It's probably all the same turns. Restore... Oh shit, it's cold. We forgot about that. Restore health potion stuff. Sure, why not? But yeah, that, that's where we'll leave it for this episode. Uh, next episode we'll carry on with the Death Brand stuff. Maybe get into taking on Mirak and uh, wrecking his shit. But uh, there's no rush on it really. Is there? We, we do want to give retribution. We don't need to be rushing into stuff if we don't need, if we don't need to you know, focus on it. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed the episode. See you next time. Bye for now. Visit Kajit.